Hello everyone. Thank you for clicking this video because I really assume that you really want to get serious with your writing this year and that's why you're here because you want to finish a single book or three books or five books in this year. And to tell you first, the maximum books, number of books every author, an average author can finish in one year is around three to six books and six is the maximum. And for a beginner writer, having achieved at least one book or one novel this year is already a great achievement. It's something that you should brag or whatever, or uh, something to share to, to your readers, to your family, to your friends, if they're really interested in your work. You know, because not everyone can understand, can appreciate your work. But the thing is, you really want to achieve something and writing a book is not possible to everyone's taste buds it's not everyone doing it and in fact 97 percent of those people who just start to write a book but never finished and only three percent are really committed to finish the work and now that you're in this video i assume that you want to belong on the three percent the 3% people, this top 3% are really committed, dedicated, passionate of their work. The passionate to the point that they really go through obsession with novel writing and all that they're thinking is their stories and what book should they write next. Yeah. And today I will be talking about how I was able to finish three books in one year using this tool. And this tool is not really expensive. It's not even uh, as grandiose like other tools out there. And it's super minimalist. So I should say it's totally simple tool that um, Jacob Wright uh, from Colorado, USA, developed and created because of his passion in writing. And because of his overwhelming passion to help beginner writers, beginner novelists, beginner authors to finish their work, he created this program, this software for people like me who was, who was really desperate to finish one work. And with his help, I was able to finish not only one but three books and yeah, three books using his tool so because i was so happy with the experience i really like to share it with you but before that i would like to tell you what i've achieved with with the tool that i used because of that tool i was able to write three books in one year I was able to finish a 100,000 word novel in one month. That's the first draft of my book. And it really reached to 100,000 words without knowing it. I was so passionate with the work, with the book, with the story, with the characters and so on. And I didn't notice that it reached 200 to 100,000 words novel and then by the next month i wanted to continue and finish another novel with sixty thousand words just in the next month so back in late 2018 i had this passion i had this dedication that what if it's really a big question in my mind uh, what if I could finish more than one? I finished earlier with one book. And and I really plan to, to have another one again. So that's where the 100,000 would come comes in. And then the next month I wanted to achieve more because I was a bit uh, surprised with how cool this tool is and how simple it is to use. So I was able to achieve again 60,000 word novel um, around November 2018. And then that same month too, I was able to win NaNoWriMo 2018 because of the story. After just one try, it was my first time to join NaNoWriMo and I won immediately because of this tool. 
And the average daily word count I have in the tool is 3,000. So that's how great the tool is. And in comparison with other softwares, it's not really confusing to use because it's really intended to make you focus on the writing per se. So it's really enticing. So imagine yourself in my shoes. You're so desperate to finish one work and then here you are, you can achieve. It's possible to achieve. There's a possibility that you can achieve one book, two books, three books in one single year or more. So if you could reach six, that's really wow. I really should clap hands for you because it's something not everyone can achieve. Not even me. Okay. So before that, again, it was just a brief introduction of of what you could do, what you can achieve based on what I have achieved. So that's your possibility. You can go through, you can go more beyond what I have achieved. So you can um, refer to, to that as a base, yeah, as a baseline of the possibilities. But as a an author, as a writer using this tool, you can go beyond. Okay, so of course, this is just a tool, but the planning involved is requiring you to have this uh, pre-planned story in mind before you use this tool. You can't just, uh, okay, download this tool and you immediately expect something great. You have to go through the pre pre-writing phase, the planning phase, because your goal is to finish one book or novel in 2019 using this tool, if not more than one. So you have to understand first the basics, which is involved in pre-writing phase. And in pre-writing phase, that's where your theme, your idea, your message, your promise, your character profile, your settings your scene sketches, your novel outline comes in. And in your pre-writing phase, these are some of the ingredients that you need to prepare beforehand before you can use this tool. Because once you use the tool, it's a writing process already. So you have to have this basics, the pre-writing phase, all of this in mind before you can go to the tool. If not, uh, it will go round and round without a point. Yeah, it will be pointless. And you'll go through another chapter to the next and then without knowing what to do, what to write. And then here comes the midpoint crisis. Boom, writer's block. So we have to avoid that. So are you ready? This will be a comprehensive review of Table Writer. This is actually the the one that I'm using over the few months which i discovered and it's really nice to, to use that so here we are i'll go through double this is the software that which i'm referring about so you click that logo that icon and then once you get to the landing page this is where you see that there's a quote there about writing and all of that um actually it will be different codes per day it's actually different codes per day it's either you can read that or not because it's just uh popping out out of nowhere once you click on the software and here you are you see my drafts these are my recent projects and these are some of these are finished and this is one of those so you see, these are all the plan. These are all the chapters on the side. So that's what you will achieve. Actually, this is one. This is the finished work that I've been doing, which I referred as uh, before with the hundred thousand word count. Yeah, from the first draft. So from after all revisions, it reached ninety thousand. Okay. Yeah. So. The thing here is, 
So you can monitor all your recent projects here. And then when you want to, to write your story, assuming you already have all the plans with you. So you can click here. So let's say your next project is Love is All Around. This will be your first book. Let's assume, yeah. So on the side, you see here the goals and stats. If you are a NaNoWriMo participant, you will see all your details here. So I'm not sure if you can see, still see it here. Yes, here. So this, I didn't. Okay, when I joined NaNoWriMo, there was a logo of NaNoWriMo here and all of the stats here. And then um, it will help you go through the um, tracking process each day while you're writing per month. Yeah, because NaNoWriMo is a 30-day book writing project. So Double helps you to achieve that, to, to, to monitor that um, daily count. So let's go back here. Okay. So assuming you already have this, the pre-writing phase, like the premise, the book idea, you already have a nice book in mind, you want to write that, and you already have the title. Well, you don't have to, ex to, to make the final title here yet because you're just playing around, you're still in the process of thinking about things, and it's still raw. So you just have this love is all around, let's say, and then your your name. And then you go through. Um, the first thing I usually do is not really touch the chapter. I go through the plot. So this is the plot grid. So you, you, if you're familiar with J.K. Rowling, um, J.K. Rowling's technique on writing Harry Potter series, you see there's squares there's some um, uh, it's a, a piece of paper divided with different sections and with different boxes so you see um with this one you see this is um this is just a summary so when you go through the plot no not this one another one Nice bind eyes. Okay. So you see, th there's um, you you have the option to create new grid plot. So you have the instead of using index cards, the traditional index cards, or you using a piece of paper to 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 draft your plot, you can use this one. And this is the introduction of what you can do. What's the possibility with the plot grid? And in my case, with Lice Buying Ties, I have this. So I created it this way. Like, I put it in a position of, um, in different perspectives. From Gia to Alessandro to the private detective to Mattis and blah, blah. So me, as um, an author, as a writer of this story, you can see overall what will happen to the story based on different perspectives, based on different scenarios, based on different angles. So from reading that, you will see, ah, oh, I should put this one here, or I should put this one back here, or I should delete that one. I don't like that. Or you revise, yeah? You can click this one, see when you click this box, you see, immediately this in index card so it's assumed that this is your um this our series of index cards here yeah, and then that's where you start usually that's where i start yeah it's up to you but today usually i start with the plot and then i will write all the 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 things that i want to include in the story and then assuming there, so assuming I finish that, yes, there, and then go through prologue, 
and then next chapter to the next chapter chapter three four and the rest yeah and on the side you will see here a series of like barcodes <laughs> as barcodes they look like one anyway um as you see these are the last 30 days project and you will monitor your progress and you see i have a i've not been writing that much with this book because of writing on the blog and and full-time work yeah because i'm a writer too and if you write today let's say uh, i'll add another one by the way the, when you add that in another chapter you just click this plus sign and then create see you you will see this uh, pop out and you'll see new scene new chapter new part new book new plot line new plot grid new note or folder so let's say i will write another scene because i want to add another scene for this one so it will automatically give you a page where you can write anything you have in mind and let's say uh So assuming this is your first sentence, and well, this is this looks like crap, yeah. But this is just for the the for the show. This is just for you to to see what will happen. You saw how the sidebars uh was in was somehow how should I say the sidebars were gone. Yeah, in simple terms. The sidebars were gone as soon as you start writing. It lets you focus on what you will write and what is on the page, not really distracted on uh, whatever uh, on the sides. You see this, ah, oh, I'm still at my 15 word count. So when you keep writing, uh, just type in. So it, you'll see. All the sidebars, left and right, are gone. And once you hover or touch your mouse or your trackpad, you'll see the sidebars again. So this is what I love about this software because it really lets you focus on what you will write today. Not really um, concerning about the word count. Yeah, of course, word count is important at least 500 words 2000 words or 3000 words per day because you want to achieve something big but if you keep thinking about these numbers you will not achieve the perfect not really the perfect story but the best story that you can make because you're too focused with the figures and you're too focused on how many chapters you made you're too focused with the number of words so double makes you focus on the story not what the figure says about you today it's not just about the goals but it's about the story the movement the, the progress of the story so once you click back on the main chapter you see see you have this a series of scenes here so once you scroll down on and then you have this you will combine these scenes later on uh, where could i insert that here or there in this paragraph wherever it's really make you f uh, add stories add scenes add settings add or adjust settings add dialogues to wherever you want because of these notes here and aside from that Double Writer also allows you to have the story notes. It's either word building, maybe you found another word and that really makes you, wow, I want to use that. So another thing is you, you also have the chance to 
to make a character profile. And we know character profiling is one of the tedious work because you have to define each character to who they are, to 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 avoid um identical ad, identical identities. And so your readers will know ah this is Alessandro, this is Raul, this is Gia. This is her tone, this is her manner of speaking, this is the way Alessandro um do the convert that's the conversations so you have to be careful on that you have to keep that in mind too so it's a lot of stuff for authors to handle so double does it for you double allows you to organize your thoughts your word building or whatever you have in mind and achieve what its goal the goal here is to finish your book and because of this because of doing all of this i was able to finish three books in one year of course this is again this is a uh, a tool but this alone will not guarantee you yeah this will not guarantee you that you can succeed if you don't have a plan in mind, if you're a pantser, you will go elsewhere. You will get confused. I was a pantser. I was just sitting in front of the desk and just stare at the blank page and write. I don't have plans. I don't have anything at hand. And in the long run, of course, at, at first, it would be nice. Yeah, it would be, wow, this is a nice story. This is a nice story. I keep going. And then in the middle... Ah, the midpoint crisis comes in. I'm confused. Ah, oh, well, what part did I wrote that? What part did I take that? I should take this. I should take that. What if? Ah, oh, I'm so confused now. I was a pantser and I didn't achieve a single thing. I All of my works in the past are all unfinished. Because, well, I didn't like what I wrote. Yeah, I really didn't like it because of... Was, uh, there's no plan yeah and that's not your goal this time you want to 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 finish with the best story with the um nice best selling stories this year not best selling at, at least yeah at least finish one book this year and that's your goal that's why you're here and this is the goal of this post this is the goal of this video but uh, just to tell you the basics of um, what double writer gives you, and the thing is, if you are a NaNoWriMo winner, I was a NaNoWriMo winner in two thousand eighteen. So Jacob, the the founder, the creator of the software, gave me a whole year fifty percent discount. So ex so within when I joined NaNoWriMo, I I joined around September. I registered to to join the competition. And then somewhere around November, uh, I I saw this double as one of the sponsors of NaNoWriMo. And there I clicked and was so curious about. So I clicked there and then um, while writing all, double notified me. I, uh, I reached the, the goal, the word count goal, 50,000 for 30 days. And with that, uh, he gave me instead of a fourteen day trial, he gave me um a lot of huge freebie, so I didn't have to pay my uh the, the bill for October because I registered in October, November, and then I had to pay by December. That's when I started um, the, the journey, and I really enjoyed the discounts he gave he's so generous about that and aside from that he gave me 50 percent discount all year so until from the point i was writing the time that i recorded this video for you until december i will have 50 percent discount so instead of paying ten dollars approximate i just had to pay five dollars per month and Disclosure, double writer is for writers. Novel writing 
he can go also with non-fiction writing here yeah but most of the time this is for novel writing only the structure itself you'll see i'll show you let's say accidental quest and then i want to export that You click this one, this three point button. There. I want to see the whole book, so that's why. Ah, I really want to see the whole book, so we'll see how it looks. So you export that to, to text file or to Word. If you have MS Word in your software, in your system, you can go that, go through, and then you go through your documents, and then you see. So you see this, yeah? But if you want to go back and then the word you click that today so um, okay this is what you see and then from recent files right click I'll go open with because I don't have MS Word And then you wait, and then you'll see the processed file automatically. Automatically, double will do the format. Actually, this is the format of the manuscript you, you will be submitting to your professional editor once you go um, to the next stage after writing process. You have yourself editing, and then here comes the editor, the professional editor sits with you. So you don't have to um, format this to, to, to how it should be because Double is already preparing that for you. It's already formatted to how it should be with the manuscript. So this is a 315 page manuscript and you will just print that and then submit to publishing agency, to your professional editor if you have because um, this will be the same format this will be the same file that you will submit to them so you don't have to have problems to make hassle how to format your book because Dabble does it for you so again Dabble Writer is one of my favorite it's really my favorite um, and recommended tool for novel writers out there if you want to finish your book because I did and I was able to finish three books in one year because of this because I was so focused using this tool and the difference is when I wrote Accidental Quest with with the use of a, an ordinary word processor I had so much distractions I was so into the figures because I could see that below and there was something with double right that I couldn't feel with writing in, uh, in an MS Word or any word processor so that's why i really recommend you to download and give it a try if you have time you can download that there there is this option in their in their website wherein you could um have a 14 day trial and you can just roam around and have a feel of it and then you'll see the difference that it makes so that would be all. I hope that you're learning a lot from me today. I really hope that you did because this is uh, really this is all that I could share because this is everything that I've experienced over the past few months using Double Writer. And this is the exact tool that I used that allowed me to finish something big in 2018. And if you want to try it, you can go through the website and download 
and have a feel of it within 14 days and if you're not you're not satisfied then it's okay you can search for another software but if you are i really guarantee you really nice yeah especially if you are participant of nanoremo you can uh try that and see how generous Jacob Wright is when it comes to giving off offers and discounts to aspiring writers like you. So that would be all. Thank you for listening for this lengthy video and I hope that you enjoyed and learned a lot. See you next time.